The thing is, these medications don't just make you lose fat. They cut your hunger, okay, and you lose tissue from everywhere in your body. Not just fat mass, but also, importantly, muscle mass. And by the way, this will happen with any diet that you're on if you drastically reduce how much you're eating. But it's important to understand that you're not just losing fat, okay? The studies say that up to 30% of the weight lost actually comes from your muscle. And you might feel like, oh, well, I don't care. Well, you should care because once you stop taking these medications, if you gain the weight back, which is happening in a lot of cases, in most cases, actually. What does it say here in the study? It says, one year after withdrawal of one of these drugs, participants regained two-thirds of their prior weight loss. And this is one of, from one of the manufacturers of these medications. So people on average regain two-thirds of the weight that they've lost. But, and here's the key, the weight that you gain back is pure fat. So you might end up in a situation where you've lost a lot of weight, you've lost fat and muscle, and then you just regain fat. So you end up in a situation where you just lost a bunch of muscle, and now you have all this fat mass, which is not very healthy. We need muscle for longevity. We need muscle to stay healthy, to help our metabolism, to ward off diseases. Having muscle mass is really, really, really important. So that's something you absolutely have to know about these medications.